Alright guys, and welcome back to Grim Rewrites the Master Thief. And when I say rewrites, I don't mean edit. He's edited some, but this is a complete fucking rewrite. This is creative freedom, and he's just taken the author's intention and said, fuck it. <laughs> let's let's do it. Let's I we gotta see it through to the end, of course. We're always going to, but I What the fuck? Where can we go from here? The Master Thief has done everything required of him. Time for a face-off against the Evil Count. Make it a monster mash! We need some angry villagers. Yeah! Get angry! Wave that pitchfork! Swing that torch! Make it disgusting. <laughs> Do it now! <laughs> Okay, so that's what I thought. Grim just decided, fuck this tail. I'm turning it into. I I called it. I've n I have not played this before anyone says, oh, dude, you tipped your hat when you said monster mash. Now I. I swear on my mother's. I swear on my mother's life, I did not play this at all. And anyone who's gonna say, well, anyone can say that. I'm gonna say bullshit. Well, yes, it's true, everyone can say, oh, I swear on such and such, but I actually mean it, and since I would be a very, very sad individual if uh, my mother died, I'm going to, uh, you know, just put it out there that, no, I'm not full of shit, I, uh, you know, have not played this, and I do mean it when I say that I swear I have not, so you can take that to the bank. Let's put an end to this thing. You got it, Grim. Because apparently, like I said, you've decided, fuck this guy, fuck his tail, it sucks ass, I like, I want to rewrite, I want to redo. Super speed! Alright. Okay. Huh? For the rest. Uh-huh. Gotcha. I saw someone else with a convert. Super speed! Not a good over there, okay. Can I super speed jump it? Not quite. Nah, I can't quite do it. Where's the last one? Fuck you. There we go. There's my ride. Now we need some angry monsters. Come on, people! Put some into it. Make it rancid. As I said, let's just, you know, pretty much, let's, fuck it. We're, we're just going to, I'm rewriting this. That's essentially what he said. Fuck this, I'm rewriting this crap. Future day. Alright, buddy. Can't even imagine what the AoE we probably have. Right. Jesus, look at that roll up the hill. Look at that. I mean, look at this roll tail, seriously. It's just engulfing it. It's beautiful. Woo! Grim goes fast! Yes, you do go fast, my friend. You go really fucking fast. Got it. Do it now! See? Fat Frankensteins. I'm guessing some of these are gonna turn into maybe. Yep, there's some. Okay, so they were just going for creatures from the Black Lagoon kind of kind of deals not, not necessarily deep ones but hey like i said i'm wow fucking jeez i'm got that shit smacked out of him let's make them deal with each other the old fashioned way make it vile <laughs> okay you got it I don't even know what's left to do or what's left to say with regards to this. By the time I probably hit through some of this, it's probably over. Oh, that's how I get the coin. Stop it good. <laughs> Alright. Got the coin. Secretive is a saint in a brothel. About as useful. Here we go! But stomp it! One more reason why Halloween's the happiest <laughs> holiday on the calendar. Zombies. 
raised by vampires, werewolves, all messing with us at his Ooh, look at them go! They'll be fighting till the sun comes up! Then, they'll never know what hit them. Nice rewrite, Grim. <laughs> like, justify it for me now. Parents probably think Master Thief is a better career choice than Vampire Hunter. Steadier work, fewer occupational hazards. Thieving for the hunter is just part of the job. So many little requisites come up when you're tracking down depravity. Not available for love or money. And you really can't hire any decent help. A suspicious stranger, outlandishly dressed, and funny looking, if I do say so, turns up in the midst of gruesome doings. Heavenly saints, mother, look at the fuck that approaches our yard. Has he come to rob us? Of what, you dunce? Some dirt? Besides, that's no fop. That's our wayward son. I'd know those hideous crossed eyes anywhere. Thank you, mother. Your disposition has not mellowed with the years. Go fix some food. Stand clear of the twisted trees, boy. They're very angry, or perhaps upset. Early brought up, I'd say. They're on a rampage. Well, that's a problem, Dad. Trees don't generally do that. They may be hungry, or... They may be under the control of an agent of supreme and unnatural evil. I'll teach this one some manners. By the look in his eye, eyes, whatever, he's determined to exterminate the source of this evil. What else would he do? Go to the Count's castle. Since our thief has been away, the Count has become enamored of Dracula. Believes that imitation is the sincerest form of flattery. No apologies, Godfather. And nature is a lame excuse. Who asked you to become a blood-sucking zombie vampire? No, it won't do. You choose, you lose. Vampires are always and everywhere evil, murdering scum and must be destroyed. How do you want to go out? In combat. You and me. Mono a mono, so to speak. <laughs> but first, you must perform three tasks. After this disgusting glut of evil doing, I'm not sure you get to make any conditions. Ah, what the hell. I'm the hero here. <laughs> Indeed, and it's not like you have a choice. I still have my enormous evil powers. Finally! Characters who understand their roles in the great scheme of things. We're familiar with the Count's wicked tasks. First, steal the horse, then take the ring and sheet. Wind up with extracting two creatures from the church. Nothing basic changes, though the overarching supreme evil thing alters some of the particulars. Halt! Who goes there? Identify yourself and state your business. I don't think I like your looks. It's not my looks you need to worry about, bat boy. This nag looks like he posed for Dura. I think death was riding him. Whoa, Nelly! I'm partial to horse meat, but this one's been fed on human flesh. Maybe we'll just turn him into glue. The ring and sheet are next. But a ruse of misdirection isn't going to get it done. The monster hunter aims a little higher and gets help from an unexpected quarter. Arise, you unfortunate and maligned undead. Help me defeat the cause of your suffering. Instead of sleeping at home or mouldering properly in your graves, you're out scaring the bejesus out of everyone through no fault of your own. These pathetic zombies are no match for me. I made them. I clean my teeth with them. I use them for target practice. Die again, you repulsive crypt creeper. Vampires always underestimate zombies. Perhaps it's the smell. Though they eat what they kill and have very few attributes to recommend them, they did not choose to be evil. Come, fellows. Grab the occupied coffin. Great idea. Take the ring wearer and the whole damn bed. Zombies are surprisingly willing. Perhaps they found being used as a vampire's toothpick demeaning. Now, to the church. There haven't been any human inhabitants in this deconsecrated hulk for years. Two werewolves use the Nardex as their home base. Before I kill these rabid devil dogs, I'll scare the shite out of them. The Count did not stipulate the condition of the creatures. He did not say, bring them back alive. 
the Master Thief has fulfilled the Count's conditions. Let the Battle Royal begin. Everyone's turned out to see the show. I think I have some fans. They seem a little upset. My supporters have more than a rooting interest in the outcome. You won't be able to depend on their neutrality. That's the best you can do? The cheesy outfit and transformation supposed to make me blubber with fear? Not likely. I know who you are, Godfather. You know nothing. You are a nasty, dirty little boy, a wastrel adolescent, and soon a dead man. I'm not shaking. Though I could if you'd prefer. Massive carnage! Order of the day, Colonel Blip. Grim reporting for duty. Last man standing is a friend of mine. Conflict resolution the old fashioned way. Woohoo! Well, someone that bad, you almost hate to see them go. Upsets the balance of the universe. On the other hand, turns out the Master Thief had more than a little mean streak. He won't lack for work on Halloween. May all our stories end so well. Until next time. <laughs> Very nicely done, Grim. No justification, just... You essentially just said... God damn it, happened again. You essentially just said, that story sucked, I'm gonna rewrite it. <laughs> Okay, you know, that's, that's certainly your choice just to say the story sucked and I'm just going to rewrite it. <laughs> it was pretty fucking cool, though. I'll give him that. So, that's going to take care of it for the Master Thief. When we come back next time, we'll be picking up the next tale. This is Mr. Casual Scum signing off. You guys, of course, as always, take care of yourselves. Leave a like if you enjoyed the content. Also, subscribe to the channel. Keeps you notified when I put up these vids. Until next time, guys. Later.